Hey guys! For today's video, I'm going to be showing you my Star Wars Weekend Vinylmation. I know it's been a little while since Star Wars Weekends were on this year, but I really wanted to show you what I got. I did not actually attend any of the Star Wars Weekends this year, but luckily my brother-in-law did, and him and his wife brought me back the Vinylmation that I really wanted from the event, so big thank you to them. I really wanted the 9 inch Death Star Vinylmation. Um, I've really taken a liking to 9 inch recently. I didn't originally collect them just because they cost so much more than 3 inch and then you really have to find somewhere to put them so I never really started out with those. Um, it took me a long time before I bought one and I mostly stuck to the 3 inch but recently there have been um, some good releases especially for Star Wars so I've been getting into the 9 inch and when I saw this I just had to have it. I mean it's incredible but I'll talk about that in a second. The other one that I really wanted was the Han and Luke Medal Ceremony Heroes of Yavin set and they are both 3 inch figures as you can see and I really wanted that set just because I thought they were really really cool and I'll talk a little bit more about those too. Okay, so first we'll look at the Death Star right here. Um, I'm not sure yet if I'm going to take this out of the box or keep it in the box. The box did get a little damaged on the journey home from Florida, so maybe I will take it out. Um, I haven't decided yet. For now, I'm going to leave this in the box, so I'm sorry that I won't be taking it out to show you, but I will show you as best I can with it still in the box. So. We go in a little closer here. This is the head, which as you can see is the Death Star itself. And then moving on to the body, you can see X-Wing and TIE Fighters right there. Um, and up in the ears too, you can see right there more X-Wing on one side and more TIE Fighters on the other side. And so that is the 9 inch figure and it also comes with a 3 inch figure right here um, and he is a Death Star Trooper. So he's pretty cool too. I think he's designed really well and I think for a combo that was a really good idea to include him. And I'll show you a little in the box too. Um, so you can see the Star Wars Vinylmation right there. And what can I say about the side? just plain stars right there. Um, the back too just shows you this one figure right here with no real description of what it is. Um, it does say, it does show the, the 9 inch there and the 3 inch and I don't know if you can read that but it says that it is a limited edition of 1000. It also retailed as you can see down here by the price tag for $59.95. Um, the other side of the box, this is pretty cool, um, has the Imperial logo right here, Disney vinyl 9 inch collectible figure, and the usual Vinylmation spiel that they write on the box. The way that that is right there in the white with the stars behind it reminds me of the opening credits of the Star Wars movies. On the top we have the same Imperial logo right there, Star Wars Vinylmation. So that is the Death Star. Again, I'm leaving these guys in their box for now. I haven't decided if I will take them out or not yet. Um, so this is the Metal Ceremony Luke and Han set. Um, you can see they are dressed exactly how they are in the final scene in the throne room of A New Hope, the very first Star Wars. They are really well done. I think they look a little more cartoony as opposed to looking actually like Mark Hamill and Harrison Ford, but that really doesn't bother me because I think that it works well and it does look good. It's also very difficult to design human figures. I really love Han's look and Han's expression and Luke's blue eyes. The ears are pretty plain, um, as you can see right there, just plain, kind of a beigey color. The outfits are spot on. Really, really love their outfits. The medals, of course, are perfect too. It would have been cool to see the medals as accessories, but as long as they look true to life, then I think it's good. Um, their shoes also are really shiny. That's pretty cool. So there's the two of them. And again, their box is pretty plain too. A lot of stars. Star Wars Vinylmation 5 on the side. 
Um, this was a limited edition of 2500 and the artist on these figures was Maria Klapsis. And you can see the top right there. The set also retailed for $29.95. And that is the Metal Ceremony set. Well, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope it was cool to see these Vinylmation a little better than you would see them as pictures on Disney's website. So I hope you enjoyed that, even though they're not out of the boxes right now. Thank you guys for watching. Have a magical day.